When you go on stage for that competition, you better be on fire. Brooke, you're doing a solo. Kathy has a girl entered your age. I want you to make applesauce out of that kid. Backstage, freak that kid out. I want that kid in tears before she ever steps on that stage. All right, candy apples, applesauce. Squish them. All right, moms, you're dismissed. Girls, spread apart. Let's warm up and start doing the number. Let's go. Music. How are you? Good lord. We just oh want to say stand up tall. So what did you think uh -huh. of your first pyramid? Yeah, you never know. I didn't know what to expect. I really didn't think she'd be on the bottom. Because yeah, but Jill, you're new. Like, I know. I, I you're new. know, but I still, I thought that was a lot of pressure on a little kid. Kendall absolutely should be on the bottom of that pyramid. I think Kendall should take a permanent residency at the bottom of the pyramid. We've been dealing with this one for a long time. You've got like three days under your belt, sister. Get used to the bottom row. I do this. The number we're doing for Rising Star is called the Bad Apples. It's a 1940s number, a little Andrew Sisters, a little Katy Perry, and also a little jab to Kathy from Candy Apple. Three days, she learned a solo. They switched the music the night before. That's well, what we do every world. week. Every I have it still has no music. I just don't understand why she couldn't have thrown her a little bone. Jill was up there bitching because Kendall was at the bottom. I just don't get it. I've been at Abby's studio for 30 years, and my kids are always at the bottom. She's already starting off on a bad foot. I don't think it's fair for her to put the new kid who did a solo and did well at the bottom of the pyramid. Do you think it's okay for a kid who's been here for nine years to be at the bottom of the pyramid? Basically, Nia, Chloe, or Maddie have to be bumped down in order for it to be okay, is what I'm hearing. Well, he, that's sort of. That's what yeah. I'm hearing. In order for Kendall to go up, someone on top has to go down. Who has to go down? Is it Nia? Is it Chloe? Is it Maddie? I had an idea of who she suspected should be at the bottom of the pyramid. Uh, it's well, so Nia. subjective. Better than Nia? Well, I think had Kendall and Nia competed directly against each other, I, I do. I mean, that's just, I'm just being honest, Holly. Kendall was the star at her studio, and now she's not the star. And I think that's really hard for Jill to handle. You say you want to be accepted and you want to be part of the group, but then you come in here and like, you can't lay down the gauntlet saying, my kid's better than all of your kids. I kind of think of this group a little bit like a sorority. Like, you pledge a little bit, you kind of like, mm, you sit back, you pay your dues, and then you get to the top. Like, I don't think you can come in here expecting to be like, boom, I'm at the top because I say so. I think she deserves it. We all work. I can't worry about your kids. I gotta worry about mine. Don't worry about my daughter. I I'm can't. just telling you she's not gonna give you everything because she doesn't give me everything, and I've been here a whole hell of a lot longer than you.